In RPG Maker MZ, events are the driving force behind almost every interactive component of your project. They are used for cutscenes, conversations between characters, displaying text-based information to the player, receiving items, and more. There are three ways to use events in RPG Maker. Map events, battle events, and common events. Battle events and common events are explained in further detail in my database tutorials explaining the Troops tab and Common Events tab, so this video will show you how to create a map event. Map events can be interacted with while the player is on that map, either by intentionally using the movement buttons to approach or interact with the event, or as a process that runs in the background. To create a new event, locate the Event Layer button on the top bar. This will place a grid over the top of your map. You can right-click a square on this grid and click New to create a new event. You can also double-click on a square to do this. It's worth noting the other options listed here when you right-click, such as Quick Event Creation and Set Starting Position. Quick event creation is a handy way to create new events from a template, such as doors and treasure chests. Set starting position will let you choose where the player will begin, as well as where each vehicle will be when the game starts. You can only have one of each of these events in your project. Once you've created a new event, the event editor will appear. By clicking apply or OK, your event's details will be saved and it will appear on the map. You can delete events from the map by right-clicking them and clicking delete, or just clicking them and pressing the delete button on your keyboard. You can also quickly view how many events are on the selected map through the event list on the left of the screen. In the next video, we'll go more in depth on how to use the event editor. Thanks for watching, and happy game developing!